course, they tell me in the last episode, we're ready to go after Fort Mercer. And we've got to yeah. go see the marshal first. I mean, we are exploring a little bit more of the land, which I'm okay with. We're going to go check out the marshal, see what he's up to. Honestly, the marshal episodes are a lot of fun. Usually a lot of killing going on in those, so... You boys are looking for some trouble? I didn't think so, bitch. Bro, definitely a nice day out here, dude. Now, hopefully sooner or later, we can make it to Mexico. Because all I keep thinking about in Mexico is that one building with the machine gun attached to it. And you can just sit there and blast bitches all day long. I really don't think we've ever been up to this area yet. So it would be a good thing to be able to relocate around here through the fast travels. Whoa, what is that? Is that a cougar? Now, yeah, killer captured the two... Are you boys fleeing? Oh, I reckon you might be. I got you. One down. One on the run. Where you at, boy? I see you running. You can run. But you can't hide, motherfucker. Where's my reward at? You'll get along fine here, son. What? Where's my reward, mister? Oh, okay, five bucks. I got $89. That's plenty of money to gamble and buy hookers with. Oh, Fort Mercer. Uh-oh, maybe we are going to Fort Mercer. Hold on, let me just show these guys what I mean later on. I'll be back, motherfuckers! A little taste of what you're dealing with. Yeah, yeah! Fucking savage John Marsden. Dude, look how big Fort Mercer is, bro. When we go in there, the machine gun is a must, bro. We don't have, oh, oh, we are doing Fort Mercer. Oh my god. We're taking over Fort Mercer. I think we are. I was wrong, boys. It's going down. It's me against the world right now. Look at the determination now. If you guys missed the last episode, go and check it out. I've got the whole posse with me, man. Gentlemen. <clears throat> you see him in there? It's time. We must go. Why? What's happening? Seth has managed to get himself inside. <laughs> but we can't leave it too long, or they will soon realize how very curious he is and remove him from the premises. Fucking or Seth, bro. Shoot his throat and watch him bleed to death. But for a minute, he will delight and amuse them. That's when he'll get us inside. Okay. Marshals of the law, when the shooting starts, take that as your cue to start awarding each other medals. Huh? I mean, take that as a cue to get inside and clean up the mess. Oh, oh he's so fucking so dumb. It is vital we stop him. Agreed. That man is a stone-cold killer. Williamson's a proud fool. The question is which will win out between his pride and his instinct for survival. The boys are back in town. The boys are back in town. I'm going in by the fucking guns hot. I'm going to shoot every one of them right in the leg. Oh, God. Esconce yourself in the back of my wagon, John, so that we can make our grand entrance. Oh, my God. We have ever since we started this game, we have been working for this moment. Come on. Let's go. And now it's the open. Oh, do we at least test the machine gun to make sure it works? All right, good. Now just stay put till I tell you otherwise. That scoundrel Seth had better not let us down. He, yeah, yeah, Once yeah, we're inside, damn now, right he better not let us down. He's into a false sense of security with some beguiling sales patter. I will give you the signal. What signal? The moment you hear a sharp rap on the side of the wagon, rise like the phoenix and start shooting like you've never shot before. This is it, my dear boy. A moment of truth. Me and you, John. Yo, Wes Dickens, when shit hits the fan, just... This is going to have to be the performance just hide. of my life. I hope my nerves don't get the better of me. I'll be honest with you, John. I'm a little jittery. John? John? It reeks of miracles back here. Thank yeah. God. 
I'll be ready with that machine gun, my dear boy. I'll be a sitting duck in there. Bro, I probably should have shot the guys. Because then now they're gonna know I'm coming. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Hey, hey there! I kill eight people in my come fucking sleep. Come on in, come on in. Welcome to my humble abode. <laughs> come on! <laughs> yeah! Where's Williamson Greetings, at? Greetings, my good men. <laughs> what would you say if I said immortality was at hand? What would you say if I told you I could teach you to fly? <laughs> what would you say if I told you I could turn a man into a beautiful woman? <laughs> Impossible, yes, once, but no more. Gentlemen, I bring you wisdom from the East. I have here in this wagon some of the finest goods, the best medicines, and the newest inventions available for you and your families. Exotic trinkets from the far reaches of the earth. We Elixirs ready, boys. Vigor and strength. <laughs> and uh, for you men of physical skill I feel like the machine gun's not going to work. Physique, uh, this miraculous elixir can keep the muscles supple and relax the cords. It loosens the joints and gives a feeling of vigor and freshness to the whole system. Why, some men have reported to me that after drinking it for one month, they can chew through steel. <laughs> oh, boy, I'm ready. Hey, boys! Yeah, motherfucker! You ready? No, no. Oh my God!
fuck is Bill Williamson? Come on, stay with me, boy. That's the last of them. We still can't find Williamson anywhere. Hey, it's the snake oil guy. General Adam, let me in, for goodness sake. That fool must be hiding. Man, it is time to start tearing this place apart and find out where he's cowering. You got a sense of urgency here, please? Open the gate. It's the snake oil guy. What Get the, the goddamn gate open and lock it behind him. Oh, God, there's a trap. Oh, we've got company, gentlemen. These scoundrels have got reinforcements riding this way. Oh, my good Lord above. There must be a hundred of them. Holy shit. Let me see this. Can't trust Piggy. Lego boys! Yee motherfucking high! I hope I shoot the kill, baby! Shoot that, baby! Oh, they got a goblin gun too! Oh god, they got a gun too! Shoot the TNT on there! Shoot the TNT! Ah! Hold up there, boy! What's your name? Go get some, huh? Should've stayed home with your mommy, bitch! They ride in from everywhere! Them up, then I yeah. I can't see anymore. I think we did it, boys. Bill ain't here. We looked everywhere. Oh, hold on. Where the fuck is he, man? Oh, darn, I missed it. Mr. Marston, we got a live one. He says, Bill's already run off to Mexico yesterday morning. <laughs> You'll never get him. Javier Escuela. He's gone to see Javier Escuela. That should make things interesting. Where in Mexico? How should I know? Oh! <laughs> Where in Mexico, you little shit? I like Piggy more, man. Piggy pretty cool. Some place near Chuparosa. Oh, are we <laughs> going to Chuparosa, huh? <laughs> That's bandit country. Chupa feckin' Rosa. Oh, I'll take you there, John. I'm real popular down there. You just meet me at the ferry. I've got lots of friends down south. I'll see you at the ferry, Irish. I'll just get me things. I'm sorry about this, John. I guess you'll be heading to Mexico. Look like I caught him, bro. We're going to Mexico. How is it down there? Wonderful. A sweet, peace-loving people with the love of social justice. May you always find coin in your pocket. It's been a pleasure spending time with you, boy. You too, you Mr. Too, West sir. Dickens. Marshal. All right, boys. Well, boys. That's enough. Can you say, Viva la Mexico!